Yeah, I'm Don, Don Baxter. I am the CEO of Salon Graphite, and I became CEO in, in early June. And uh, my background is, is mining engineering and, and graphite. So I'm hot, well positioned to do this. So Salon so Graphite, uh, we're on track to be a preeminent, preeminent global supplier of high margin value added graphite and graphene products. Uh, Salon will achieve this mission by becoming a fully integrated mine to battery processor of battery quality graphite to be sold to electric vehicles, OEMs uh, across the globe. Um, what sets us apart from our peers is the high grade of our vein graphite resources that can be scalable and profitably mined while practicing environmental excellence. Accordingly, we'll be able to provide OEM battery makers a reliable, secure source of graphite outside of China uh, that meets their very high ESG standards. So today I'm going to talk about uh, our resource, uh, why we're uniquely positioned to take advantage of the growth of demand for electric vehicles, uh, the options we have to develop our assets into fully integrated mine to battery processors of graphite, uh, and graphite itself, its uses, supply demand as it comes to the battery sector. We are uniquely positioned to check every box required to make an offtake agreement with an EV OEM, such as Tesla. Uh, it's not all about Tesla, but Tesla's the main one. We're looking more at Volkswagen, General Motors, uh, because um, our graphite has demonstrated a suitability for use in electric vehicle batteries, and it's been proved to be more than efficient than the synthetic alternatives, uh, primarily from China. Uh, and that's the big issue here, the environmental issues from China. Uh, results came in at 382 milliamp hours per gram for our reversible capacity, which is beyond what is expected for the best currently commercial use synthetic graphite, uh, a reversible capacity of about 363. Our biggest thing now, proving our graphite is, is as good as it is, it's our ability to supply sufficient quantities uh, with security of supply from the mine site or multiple mine sites. And we are also proving to be the most environmentally sustainable uh, with a high grade direct shipping ore from underground mines that do not require a mill or a tailings pond. Uh, we mine it from underground and it's ready to go straight to the battery. By first raising about 5 million to bring the first two of 10 mines into production, actually it'll be slightly more than that. Um, each of which costs about $2 million to develop at an initial rate of about 5,000 tons per annum. I'm looking at trying to squeeze more out of each mine, uh, but we, we can sell unprocessed graphite at $1,800 a ton uh, with a 70% gross margin after royalties. So at 50,000 tons per year, revenue would be approximately 90 million per year. We'll use production to satisfy all requirements to negotiate an optic deal with a major OEM. We're looking that to do that hopefully within the next year. Uh, we use offtake agreements to finance a uh, financing of the processing facility, be around 50, 60 million dollars to upgrade unprocessed graphite from the mine to battery quality material and increase selling price from $1,800 a ton to $10,000 a ton for a processed anode ready graphite. So at 50,000 tons per annum, our revenues could increase to about 500 million per year. Um, the chart you're looking at right now shows the timetable of achieving these objectives. Uh, the most important catalyst being the negotiation of an offtake with a, with a major OEM. We're in discussions now with that, and uh, the exciting part is that now we're starting to see our battery results come out. We have more to come um, as we get better, uh, including our silicon enhanced materials, which I think are going to get a lot of excitement in the space. I see a tsunami of demand coming for processed graphite for anodes. Uh, this can result in an increased price even from, from companies such as Volkswagen and, and, and uh, others that are concerned about supply. The chart you're looking at right now uh, is from Benchmark Mineral Intelligence. It's showing 4 million tons demand by 2030 for um, processed graphite for batteries. So a couple of months ago, that chart was showing 3 million tons. So we're definitely seeing an increased demand. And again, the tsunami of demand that's coming. And I think the OEMs and the battery manufacturers are really starting to wake up to that. So companies like Salon uh, are very much on their radar right now. We believe this illustrates why we are optimistic that Salon will become a preeminent global supplier of high quality graphite to the global OEM electric vehicle battery manufacturers. Uh, we meet all the requirements the OEMs re require for processed graphite. You know, ESG is a big factor there. So we're strong in that area uh, as well as quality of material. But let me leave you with a couple of uh, points to think about. Um, 
we can scale up production and grow out of free cash flows at the, the vein graphite price of $1,800 a ton, which is straight out of the mine. Um, after bringing you know, our first two full mines into production, and we have 10 more to go beyond that. Um, once we have an offtake with, a, a, with an OEM, uh, be it a cell manufacturer or an EV, uh, we can finance and develop a process that will allow us to increase our selling price from $1,800 a ton to $10,000 a ton. Um, and corresponding revenues from 90 million a year to over 500 million with gross margins after royalties. So we're at the cusp of this thing, uh, really taking off this whole space is more of an, a revolution. Uh, and Salon Graphite is well positioned to take advantage of this. So, you know, I ask you to keep watching these videos, keep following us and uh, let us um, prove you what we can do. And we're pretty excited that we can show some strong value in this in this uh, company and uh, achieve some great things. So I look forward to the next uh, video we do and keeping everybody in, in touch and, and in contact with what we're doing. Thanks very much.